just got to do this time, Barney. I think if every one mana cost you stay one now. Don't tell the others. I'll be rooting for you. Welcome back. How's it going out? Oh my god. Bum 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 bum. Did he keep the token? You think you like this? Uh, six, four. Yeah. Thanks for pointing it out, Prohamid. You're right. When did you become an ELO slave? Jesus! And I hope you're joking. There's like a lot of sensitive antis over here. I like I like people that don't get offended like by freaking uh, like how I don't even know what I'm doing. Just Prohamid, like I didn't like you know what Raishka Raishka whispered me. Uh, you were here yesterday when Raishka was there, right? Wait, wait, you're an OG viewer, right? Kind of, not really. It says following since 2021. 20, like for he's like man, it's like if you would read what he wrote me. It's like I'm I'm sorry. For whatever is happening, I I'm I, I told him I'm sorry for whatever, I, I don't know, I don't want to say exactly what I told him, but it's like, you know, it's like sometimes, I, I noticed this because I have, I work real life with people, real people, <laughs> not that you guys are not real people, but with people, it's like usually when somebody's like super, nice work out there. if somebody starts suddenly like yelling and shit, to some small, something small that happen that is happening usually something else is an issue it's like when you say why did you do this and then he starts fucking raging you know and then you're like whoa chill <laughs> you know and then usually and then what what is what happened is for example with somebody where this happened was like his um father-in-law died right and then he went through that but it's like you hear it from somebody else then. But it's like usually when somebody's like super ex exaggerating. You were here yesterday with the Maya thing situation, right? You, you were here, right? Tell me if you were here. I don't know if you were here. Yeah, I was like, you know, it was like the hero pick stage. I can explain you the situation. So there was like the hero pick stage. I didn't pick Maiev. I picked like the pyramid and then he, he wrote like five times or so. Yeah, if you had Maiev now, you know, you would not be in this situation. And then like after three or four times, it's like, dude, I get it. I did not pick Maiev. You know what I mean? It's like, I get it. Yes, I know. I did not pick my F. It's like it's pointless to to keep pointing it out. You know what I mean?
But it was not a big deal. I just said like, it's like, I get it. I don't have my, like you said it like 10 times, okay? And then he was like, then he tried to, he's like, yeah, time to watch another stream or something. And I was like, whoa. So he tried to hurt me like emotionally. And then he wrote me like a letter, like a letter that he stopped, like he, he's like one of my biggest supporters. And he's like, he's, he will stop supporting me. All the years are down the drain and whatever. It's like, it's like, bro, what the fuck, man? <laughs> it's a, it's, it was not a big deal. Like it was really not a big deal. It's like, it's like exaggerating drama to the highest of levels. Yeah, it's like, but bro, it's like, I can tell you now, almost like 99% guaranteed that something else is happening, you know, in the life or whatever. It's like almost fucking guaranteed. Oh, baby. Almost fucking guaranteed, bro. You like this turn? Bro! 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 Triple bro! Bro! Which one do we take? Bro, we gotta pick the dancing spawn here. But <laughs> do I gotta be dumb, but, but dazzling spot, bro. You know how P it is. You know it. It's like this is oh man. It's like, can you can you like can you even fuck this up? <laughs> I mean, can you talk about this? Yeah, it's because of the, oh man. Is this how you get like top two now? Am I now on the other, am I now on the long end of the stick? I never used that expression. This guy must be like, what the fuck did I just watch? I mean, bro. That's turn seven. But it has to be correct to pick the Domo. This guy is like not even that crazy, right? But it's like. It's good. I mean, it's a big deal. Like, especially these earlier rounds, people will not play around Hydra, right? And then it will just shrek people. This is how I felt in the last couple of games. Like, I feel strong and then I get absolutely smashed. Now I'm the smasher.
it's like every elemental buy is a lot of stats, right? Elemental is plus one, plus one, plus one, plus one, plus one, plus two, plus one. It's a lot of stats, right? Yeah, I need the elemental token though. This one doesn't grow as big as the other buffers, but he's still good enough. I, I like that I'm testing every hero. And bro, I'm like now four days in and I'm still... I haven't even played half of the heroes. <laughs> like once. I actually am digging Moncleave now. It's like a hero to... St it fits in the still level one meta. It's like poisonous is so hard to get. That's another thing, right? It's like these kind of boys are a huge problem if there's no poisonous, right? Like if you can make the biggest stat dude. Like for example, last game where you remember the, the, the guy that had like, like the 60-60 taunt elemental? It's like I can't kill it. And like, and I couldn't get poisonous. So my only chance was just to outstart somehow, but I couldn't. Like these guys, like this thing. It's not just hitting a poisonous guy. I've been 100% on all these fights, which is. Nice work out there. Keep up the pressure. Is this what you were talking about? Because this one bus plus one plus one too, that's like almost cheating. Is this a big ass Hydra or not? I mean he gets the first attack, who gives a damn? Is this meta about getting like super super big dudes and you get rewarded for it? No, it's like, I think it's just turn 9. I think turn nine, 10 is normal for these t 3 stars. It's just like, I'm, I did this shit very fast. That's why I'm like still 100%. It looks like I have an endgame board. It's just like, this is still just turn 9. Usually you get it on turn 10, right? The 3 star. By the end, yeah, this is normal. It's funny how good this one was. Bro, 
Like, these heroes are so good, right? If you think about it. Like, the ability... Like, Cthulhu always also feels insanely good. I think I'm changing my tier list in my mind. The, the heroes that can buff board are the best heroes. That's also why Tavish is so good. You don't just get punished by, by po for both of Poisonous Morlocks so easily. Like usually, like if somebody has like just Poisonous Taunt, yeah, fuck me. But it's like, look how, it's just like nobody had it so far, it's just hard to get. Because it's so hard to get to level 10, to level 6, you have to wait for your triple, 5, level 5 triple, and then rip uh, like a Magsna, if Magsna's even in the pool, or high roll them get on. Namui! Oh, Namui! What up, girl? Are you going to... You're the third person to ask me what is happening. I'm not kidding. You're the third person, like, in the today? Are you guys all just bored? Are you playing? Bro, I did like the biggest... Yeah, it's like, what the fuck, it's so random, right? Sometimes just random things happen. Like, why now? Did something happen? It's just weird coincidence. I know Mid said, oh, are you playing? That's good, because you were like, it's good that you didn't quit. Because I lost hope after set 5. Nice. Because apparently set 6 is... Okay, okay, you wanna hear my plan? So I was playing, I had more games than anybody else in the world in set 5. Okay, listen to me. I listen to you too when you do your like, like your speeches and your, your classes, which are very good, by the way. Oh, I have to take this one. Now it's my time to... Boggies. Uh... Hey, hello? Did I disconnect? You have bought any minions this turn? Ah. I don't want to go to bed. That's a funny song. I don't want to go to bed. What is this song? I love it. Um. Wait, I wanted to say something. Okay, yeah, my plan. One, one second. Okay, 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 my plan. Yeah, 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 I know. This is crazy. Wait, today? Wait, oh, wait, should I, is now the time to get into it? Okay, listen. My plan was, the set came out in October. Freaking October, can you believe it? Time flies. No October, November, December, January. Can you believe it? Four months. So, that's insane. So, set 5, I played more games than anybody else in the world. In the world and they made the game worse with every patch. I went through the whole trauma. People said. And then I was like, for me, the way how I play games now is, also like with Blizzard, whatever, with my experience, whatever, a little bit of Boomer, whatever. For me, it's important in which direction the game is going. The developers of the game. In a positive direction or a negative direction. And they have shown me they're going into a negative direction in set 5. And then everybody is like hyping up six, six, 6. Oh, set 6, the best set the world has ever seen, bro. Oh, so good, amaze balls and blah, blah, blah. I was like, fuck. That's like no shot, Bako. But I can't just start playing set 6 after fucking 4 months in. You know it takes time to learn the stupid game. Short story long. Um, I was like, okay, if set six was the success, I will play set seven. That's basically what I wanted to say. Sorry for dragging it out for two hours. If set six is a success, I will play set seven. But now that you brought it up, 
the mid-season patch could actually be the perfect time to get into TFT. Maybe I don't have to wait for set 7. But all the championship qualifiers and whatnot, they're already over. If set 7 is bad, listen, this is plan B. I already thought about this too. If set 7 is bad, I will never ever play TFT again, not even in 10 years. No matter if you come in my stream in 6 years from now and you're like, hey, you gotta what's up? I will be like, no. If set. <laughs> I already thought about this scenario too. The TFT for set 5, 5 is going to be back in here. Oh, that's good. Yeah, if you come in in 6 years... I'm going to say no! Fuck TFT! And this is only if set 7 was bad. Mm -hmm. Already thought about it. Oh, baby, but how do I play this? Beasts. Better hire a recruit while you can. No, I mean, what do we do? Better hire a recruit while you can. Oh, God. What the fudge do we do? Any any planners? Okay, I could buy this death hero. Kill him. Easy club. What's the plan? Yo yo yo! Oh, but you say I did not watch P. Arcane. Should I watch it? Like I maybe should get a Netflix account too. The thing is, I'm working. Like, I don't have a girlfriend, so what I do is I work, I have a day job, I come back home, and then I work, then I go to sleep. So I go to the gym and I work all day and I sleep. I don't do anything else. One sixty-five on the poisons guy. Oh my god, that's actually so fucking good. That's how you play this guy. This guy's a legend. I somehow have to get another cliff out. Oh baby, we still die. Yes, Cliff. Bro. Avenge free. This is going to be very interesting. Very, very interesting. Very. Maybe go for this poisonous. 52%. Literally a coin flip. Oh my god, he has been fury. Oh my god. Oh my god. 
How the fuck am I favorite? Oh my god, the rest of his units are kinda trash. Is he dead? He's alive, that's bad. Can I face a dead guy please? Oh baby. Oh, I should level up here. Can I beat these people? I mean, I was favorite to beat him by a little bit. He's just the stats. He's a big boy Cliff. Cliff juicer, me too. I have a bigger boy Cliff juicer. He's like a big boy taunt. I have, I have two studs boys. What an annoying guy. I guess I have to replace this one. I mean, a cliff juice is very annoying. I was only 12% against this guy. Oh, because of the tomboy, but now this one is strong. This one is too weak. Why is he so big though? Wait, should I play him first? You got this. You're way ahead. Back. Welcome back! Yeah, you were not streaming. Did you stream in the last two years? Time flies. Two years feel like one year. Oh, wait, I'm good better against this guy. So wait, it's on PBE? You think that's the time to play TFT again? You know, P uh, TFT gives me a little bit of PTSD, not gonna lie. A little bit of PTSD. Oh, he has the cleave juicer. Should I? Am I scared? Oh, dude, I can do like next level strats. I can do some next level strats. I can do some nasty, nasty, nasty strats here. Check this out. Nami, are you ready? About to witness greatness. Check this out, check this out, check this out. Do you check are you checking this out? Look at this one. Look at this positioning. Look at this positioning. This is like five head, five hundred million IQ got here positioning, okay? You see this? Poggers! Do you remember trash? Yeah. I played League of <laughs> You have pretty good idea for this game. Uh yeah, Fresh Fresh is pulling fuckers in. I played League of Legends when I was like studying at university. So it's season one. I know my 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 lantern boy. I also, so I played trash in League of Legends, in Rune Terra, and in TFT. How do you not remember trash, bro? I had more games played than anybody else in the world. Look at this. You see these percentages? Ninety-two percent because of this positioning. Some people call me a misunderstood genius. Completely outplayed. Yeah, I played only like a casual 1000 games of Thresh. <laughs> yeah, but what was what was your point? Yes, I actually... Yo, you did actually DFT trauma lecture. Fuck, I missed it. That's perfect. Yeah, we kind of we kind of have like a different weird um, 